In just one week, many communities throughout the Valley will be voting on school referendums. Valley News Team's Ashley Bishop has been running the numbers for us, and she has the breakdown of two of the area's biggest votes. So, Ashley, what did you find out? We broke down several referendums and how it will impact your pocketbook if they pass. One referendum taxpayers will decide on in just three weeks will be in West Fargo. The West Fargo School District is asking for $98.1 million for a variety of projects. The district is looking to build two new elementary schools, add an addition to West Fargo High School, build a new hockey rink and swimming pool. They are also looking to do upgrades to multiple school buildings. A yes vote will increase your property taxes. A $150,000 home would see a $200 tax increase. The district says this referendum will help them with class sizes that are continue to grow. Coming up tonight at 6 on Valley News Live, we will look at what you will be voting for in Moorhead. All right, Ashley, thanks for the information. Now, to see other referendum breakdowns in the Valley, click on this story on valleynewslive.com. Residents wanting to vote for Moorhead School's November 3rd special election can cast an absentee vote. To vote by absentee ballot, residents must complete and return an application to the election clerk at Moorhead Area Public Schools. These ballots can be requested until Monday, November 2nd. Applications can be found in the school offices or online. We have a link for you on valleynewslive.com. Just click on the hot button.